So in some of my projects, I use libraries that are not included with Arduino and are not available in the Arduino library repository. And I always include a link in the comments for the code that tell you where you can find that library. But I realize not everybody knows how to actually install them. So here's a quick and easy way you can do it with any library you find on the internet. Especially when it comes to one-off devices, there can be many different libraries available, and they all vary slightly from each other. In one of the last videos, we used an MPU 6050. I used Jeff Roberg's MPU 6050 library. If you were to use any of the libraries for the MPU 6050 that are found on the Arduino repository, it just won't work. So first, we'll just copy the link to the GitHub repo for this particular library. And if you're not familiar with GitHub, it could be a little tricky at first for some people, but here are the files you're going to need, except there's no easy way to actually download them here. So someone has created a nice little utility that does it for you. Go to downgit.github.io, paste the link in there and click on the download button. From there, you'll have the downloaded zip file that contains all of the files from the original GitHub folder. Now all we need to do is go into Arduino IDE, under Sketch, Include Library, select Add Zip Library, and now you'll select the file you just downloaded. Then you'll see Library added to your libraries, and that's all there is to it. So you would do that for any library you need that is not included in the Arduino repo or is a special custom library created by somebody else and available on GitHub. It's that simple. So thanks for watching this quick tip. Please like and subscribe and help grow this channel. And if you have any questions or other topics you would like to see some quick tips on, leave suggestions down in the comments below and I'll do my best to put them together. Thanks for watching.